Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. Hey! Hurry! She's getting away! Come on! A double ambush? Okay. Didn't see that coming. She's gone again! Hurry! We gotta get across! Times the charm. They are not smart. I understand that. You know what we're doing right now? All of this? It's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So. Doesn't it make you worried? Everything we're doing now happened in the Yotnar Shrine. Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. That is our focus now. Brother, we've taken a wrong turn. Our thief's gone skyward. <laughs> From hell on. Heimdall must have grabbed this while I freed Garm. Ugh. I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. 
No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? This is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the giant said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. Another Adrian! To the left! Careful, brother. You're covered in bifrost. <laughs> 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 Walking straight into Ragnarok. Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from. Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. The lad does make some good points, though. As long as Atreus lives, so be it. There's nothing. like inside their shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Call them anytime we need them. Feels like they want us to use it at one of the altars. Perhaps Freya will know. So, in essence, they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hilda's Penny and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. Look out! Yeah! 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 
Yep. Still very, very egros. Liking it less now. That wasn't the same one from no. earlier, was it? They come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anhuryar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. So, we are poor back.
killed his Fini. Then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for masterpieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that then mask offers all the answers... surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, Father. Do all the plants they want to kill us? No, no. Only the carnaptious ones. if we shouldn't check back on the raven tree. Ah, that wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blowsinder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bela's already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. The fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. Once you see the signal, count it down. Come, Kratos. We should get moving. Nice work with the wolves. I've never seen any clips in Vanaheim before. Yeah. That just sort of happened when we freed the moon. I've seen a lot of weird things, but the moon in the box was on a whole new level. Think you're gonna be okay? His time with the Ainhir here wasn't pleasant. Well, as well as off. Some rest. What's the Witch of the Woods need? The Aesir will be running scared. You make up your mind. Get so much as a paper cut in that. You won't get so much as a paper cut in that. About time I had something to do. And Lady Freya? What are you looking for?
You know what you want? Sure stinks like Medgard. Hitting the road or chewing the fat? Toss it on the pile. Save me the trouble of getting it myself. Yeah, I'll take your crap. What you need now? We got more lip flapping to do or no? Let's make something, then. Need something special? And now for the goddess. Big man. Oh, hi. Hey, your little one. Well, he's a cutie pie. Should have seen him a couple winters ago. Ain't even at eye level no more. Oh, you hush. Ain't nothing wrong with a growing boy. Y'all change the ding-dang time of day? Okay, well, that's impressive. Brock, when you knew Faye, was she... Let me stop you right there, killer. Brock ain't one to go breaking no confidences. Not even when it comes to the dearly departed. You don't hear me spreading your business all over town, do you? Smiths don't blab. Just how it's gotta be. So, Brock, if Lunda can step between realms to travel about like you, I presume it must be the guild you know each other from. Maybe. Or maybe I just showed her a few tricks while we were tying one on. Or maybe I showed him. You don't know us, clever pants. Lunda. Would you happen to know how your light and dark elf friends came to be involved? You mean Big Fair and Baylor? Well, they were both imprisoned by one side or another, or maybe both. Escaped together, been on the run, and absolutely all over each other ever since. A dark and light elf fleeing their people together. Quite a risk. Being in love's always a risk. That's what makes it fun. You could say the same about hot cheese. Linda, what do you know of Birger the Traveler? Not much. I ain't a talking type, really. But from what I can glean, he walked the path of the Traveler for a time, then found out something that made him step off it. Hard. Any idea what he saw? No, I'm not sure, but I think he saw what was at the end of the path. And, uh, didn't care much for it. Finding out Odin was pulling their strings all along probably put a colossal kink in his codpiece. 